Shifting Sun here as they're about to score up. Uh, coming directly at us, sit on the judge, uh, down to the judge, and two laps around to run 22.70. Turbo Bromac is number nine with spots of yellow over black inside of the second row, the favourite. We are about to see them rocking and rolling. There's the twinkling light and the disco's underway for the last with down near the inside. One of the first ones away, refused service and Beta House came out quickly. They were being followed by Untie the Hood who's out three spiders deep going into the first corner. In behind those raced Miss Modern Ruby and the favourite Turbo Bromac is going to push through and be three back on the inside when they settle and balance. They're being followed by Chip Ganassi and then Flaneur and Cam Wadizzi. Further back on the field then came the Village Creek being followed through by Tamura Reactor. Second to last was Destiny Bell and the putter was grinning at the tail of the field. Grinning putter is last of all about 45 metres off the leader. They pace down the back directly into the western setting sun on the Riverina and the leader is Beta House from Albury. Beta House showed by two metres. Refused services second. Flanour is moving up quickly around the outside as they raced up to the top corner 1400 to go. They're being followed by Untie the Hood with Smother One one in the black diamonds over the yellow jacket. Further back the favourite Turbo Bramac on the inside and then Miss Modern Ruby on the outside of Chip Ganassi. Next is Cam Woodizzi, followed further back by Tamura Reactor. The village creep well back with Destiny Bell and Grinning Punter last of all 47 seconds the lead time and they've made their way into the lane now whereas they come down to the judge with a lap to play. Beta House led the way. Cam Woodizzi went up to join it at the bell. They're being followed by Refuse service and then Flanua. Turbo Bromac, the favourite, buried three back inside of Untie the Hood and the bell was peeling as they raced out to the Cartwrights Hill corner. Further back raced Chip Ganassi, followed by Miss Modern Ruby, Tamora Reactor, the Village Creep, Destiny Bell and Grinning Punter with it all to do. 800 metres in the last out of Wagga Wagga and the leader is Beta House. Camwood is his second, third. Refuse service behind the leader and they're being followed further back then as they headed down the back by Flanua. Jay Scott getting going on Grinning Punter, circumnavigating around the outside of Untie the Hood. The favourite Turbo Bromac is now four back on the inside and is in Pitt Street traffic at 5.30 on a Friday afternoon. Further back in the field then, the village creep around the outside being followed by Tamora Reactor and Chip Ganassi. Cam Woodizzi had pulled its way to the lead on the turn. Untie the Hood and Flanura there. Destiny Bill it looks to be coming from a mile back and Turbo Turbo Bromac nowhere to be seen as they came to the turn. In behind the Miss Modern Ruby. They've turned for home. Flaneur goes up. Out wider. Destiny Bell. Cam Woodizzi whacking away. Untie the hood. Drives for the inside. Grinning punter is still there. A great finish in the last of the day. Driving through along the inside. Untie the hood. Untie the hood. Races through. Takes the prize. Beats Cam Woodizzi. I think Flaneur third. Miss Modern Ruby. Grinning punter. In behind those then. Further back, Tamora Reactor, Chip Ganassi. They're followed through by Refuse Service, the Village Creep, Destiny Bell. By gee, where's the favourite? Turbo Bromac's been beaten about 45 metres. Is back second last, and back with it was Beta House.